Okay, so this is... Oh, I don't want to make this video, but it's been officially announced by Stephen Amell and the people behind Arrow that Arrow Season 8 next season will be its final season, which is very sad. And obviously Arrow was the first show ever to come and bring the Arrowverse to life, so we owe everything to it. You know, no matter if, you know, Season 4 wasn't good and it's had some blips along the way, it still remained a very consistent show, like season 5 is my favourite season, so that proves going from season 4 to season 5, and now season 7 is really good so far, with a kind of average season 6, so again, I love this show, and so many of you guys love it as well, and although we were kind of expecting this, it's kind of unexpected because I did actually believe it would go on at least for a full season because they've officially announced it's only returning for 10 episodes in the fall. So that means after the mid-season, there is no more Arrow. And I think what's going to happen is Batwoman's probably going to take up the time slot because they're shooting the first episode of Batwoman this week. If it all goes well, everything goes well and they really like the show. I think that's what's going to happen. But... This is the statement that Stephen Amell put out, and, you know, all the love to Stephen Amell in the world. I met him twice, actually, now, and I'm going to be meeting him again. I can't wait, especially after this. It's going to be kind of sad, I guess, to see him. But, yeah, at Heroes and Villains Fan Fest London, I highly recommend if you're, I guess, visiting London, visiting England, visiting Europe, or you live in London or Europe or England... 100% come to Heroes and Villains Fan Fest, and it's going to be amazing. And I'm sure Stephen will continue to do these events because he loves doing the events, no matter if he's playing Oliver Queen or not. So, this is what Stephen said Playing Oliver Queen has been the greatest professional experience of my life, but you can't be a vigilante forever. Arrow will return for a final run of 10 episodes this fall. There's so much to say. For now, I just want to say thank you. So, Again, I don't know if somehow Steven sees this video, if you guys could share it around, that would be amazing. You know, all the love to Steven, he is an excellent actor, he brought this whole Arrowverse to life, it all roots from him, you know, the, su the success of The Flash and all the shows past, but especially The Flash has rooted from him because it came from those episodes, those interactions with Barry that, you know, we had the crossovers and from then on we've had these massive crossovers, we're getting Crisis, he's going to be in Crisis just to reiterate that to you guys. And so this sort of, I guess, leans into one of the theories coming out of the Elseworlds crossover was that Oliver's probably going to die and I think this definitely backs up the idea of that because this is 10 episodes. I'm guessing maybe they will start a bit earlier or they will have like no breaks at all between the mid-season and the start. So he's definitely going to be in crisis, but is he going to die? I don't think he's going to die, but it does lean into the theory. And so I'm just so grateful for Steven and what he's done. And, you know, not just Steven, the whole show, everyone that's around, Katie Cassidy, David Ramsey, the whole lot, all the OGs and all the new people. It's been a blast and I can't wait for next season and I'm going to do my best to cover every single episode because it's the last season. I've got a true passion for the show and I'm really really sad to see it go but also Emily Bett Rickards who's been around since the very very start well not exactly the very start but you know pretty early on and then the more recent members like Echo Kellum, Juliana Harkavy, Rick Gonzalez and so on and so forth there's so many people and the crew so the showrunners the producers the writers everyone behind you know the cinematographers the directors everyone you know it's just been a blast for us as fans to watch it and it's very sad to see it go but we were kind of expecting it because it's been around for a long time but i thought it could do a supernatural but I think they've come to the decision that they're sort of better to end it right now. They feel like maybe they don't have too much else to say and they feel like maybe they're in the good place right now to end on Crisis and bring other shows forward and I think that's definitely what the CW is going to do and I don't think it's a CW pulling. They're not cancelling. It's Arrow's gone. They're finishing with the final season, 10 episodes, up till Crisis and then they're ending it. 
So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I guess if you liked it, I, I, I know you can't really like this video because it's very sad, but leave a like, leave a comment on your thoughts. Do you love Arrow? Even if you don't really like it as much as you used to, what's your feelings? Are you sad as well? Because it's very sad. And yeah, so all the love in the world to the cast and crew behind Arrow. So I'm really looking forward to the next 10 episodes in season 8 obviously we've got the rest of season 7 to go so we've got a long time so don't worry about that but i will see you guys later goodbye